Welcome to Gyro Boss DX. Um, this game is coming out on Steam in approximately six days. I think a party mode got added to the original game. I don't know what anything this. I don't know anything about this game. Let's just look at the help real quick. Story: Your home planet is under siege from a band of intergalactic pirates led by the fiendish Gyro Boss. Unfortunately, your technology is no match for this deadly beast. Every game is doomed from the start. But you'll fight with honor to complete your mission objectives and achieve the best possible score. Control types: standard controls, holding left or left on the. Or Because we're basically moving a ship clockwise and counterclockwise, or there's inverted controls, and then there's direct controls, or there's... Okay, gotcha. If the controls feel weird, try switching control type in the options menu. Visit the dust tab on the statistics menu, find out which weapons you need to practice against. Uh, in party mode, you can play a variety of games with different twists. Okay. Oh, was that it for the... Yeah, that's it. Um... So this, uh, of course, is going to be blank. Um, objectives or maybe achievements? Yes, okay. So we have any of that. Uh, you can play multiplayer, single player. Um, apparently you're just moving in a circle. Uh, and there's the options. So there's standard, holding left, will move your ship anti so counterclockwise or anti-clockwise, and then the other side will move it. Okay, so it's just, uh, graphical effects, intense. Alright, sure, whatever. Let's, uh, just head in and check it out. This game is coming out. Something evil this way comes. Cometh. Um, so, some... I don't... Okay. Uh, I had to actually prepare to stop it at all costs. So apparently this game, uh, you're just orbiting around a, a circular uh, orbit and uh, dodging projectiles against uh, by uh, the enemy. Only you can save your planet. It's time to face the gyro boss. Retro style survive objectives. Play your first full round, survive for 10 seconds, survive a spew of bullets. I'm not entirely what a spew of bullets is, but let's... Okay. Oh boy, that. <laughs> okay. Play ten rounds of Jaro Boss. All right, so. What the heck? <laughs> Let's just try again. Um, I think it's the sensitivity on the controller, so pardon me for that. Um, I'm going to switch to a directional pad instead. Oh, what? I wasn't expecting that to... So, okay. Um, I think I need to switch the controls a bit. Is there any way to change how sensitive the stick is? Nope. Inverted. I don't want inverted. Direct. I don't know. Let's try the direct. I still don't wanna, don't know what a spew of bullets is, but okay, score 500 points in one game. <clears throat> Let's just test this out. What? Oh, that's the only save area, I guess. I don't like those direct controls at all. Let me tell you. I can't use the direct controls, it, it's so messy. Uh, well, we got a high score though. Um, well, I guess we'll go back to the standard controls. 
survive for 20 seconds. So once again, 10 rounds of gyro. These are all kind of like objectives, right? So those things explode in like a little hexagonal. Best to give them a little space so you can avoid their explosions. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to stay so focused here. This is like a following. And then there's bullets coming in from the outside. So the... So the... So it just keeps on going, right? There's no... There's no such thing as uh, end of game, I think. What is going on? Are these spews of bullets? I have no idea. Wait! Uh, I thought I was totally safe. Right? Killed by a rage asteroid. Alright. Survive for 30 seconds. Oh, so that doesn't give me credit? I survived for a minute and a half almost. I guess I should just follow the objectives. Alrighty. These uh, big pills are kind of annoying because they're so big and the hitbox, the, hit, the hitboxes are kind of big. Uh, Alright, um... I don't know what a spew of bullets is. I'm thinking about inverting the controls because it works for up here, these controls, but I guess it's okay. I can just stay at the top half of the screen. What is this? What is this? <laughs> Killed by boxing glove. Well, um, let's try the inverted controls. Wait. We'll keep the graphical effects the same. Let's try the inverted controls so that we can have the. Oh my god, those things are so big! Let's go downstairs so that we can... This is a spew of bullets? I don't know what a spew of bullets is. Yeah. Oh, that is a spew of bullets! Why is that not a spew of bullets? Oh man, what on earth? Play 10 rounds, okay. Play 25 rounds, survive 30 seconds. Survive a series of locked-on explosions. So, it it's just a, a lot of different things to go through. So we have another spew of bullets. Boxing glove, how do you avoid this? Alright. I don't know how. That explosion lasts just a tad too long. Um, so, that's okay. I just, uh. I just moved a, a, a touch too quickly. I'm trying to rotate with this because it's, uh, the, um, 
What's it called? What is this? Oh, the lasers, right. So some things are easier to avoid than others. Well, I've survived for 30 seconds, so we'll get that objective. Wouldn't this be a spew of bullets? This is a scatter shot of bullets? Okay. I don't know what happened. Oh, it was like survive. Killed by s <laughs> fire brat. All right. Um, 25 rounds, a thousand points. Series of lockdown explosions. Didn't I just do that? I don't remember. These are lockdown explosions, right? That didn't work out. All right, so let's. That must have been the lockdown explosions. Not like this, just lasers. The lasers are super easy. So any of this colorful stuff is. Um, okay, so inverted controls clearly is uh, for me. Oops. Um, uh, the game doesn't want to give me credit, alright? So, you have to meet the... I wonder if it ever spews the other direction. So far it's only gone this way. In a counterclockwise manner. Fire brats. The fire brats. I mean, they do go. They do move in a. All right. So those are locked on explosions. I feel like these squids. The tail is just a touch too uh, long. But by the time. Hey, we survived a wave of fire brats. Oh gosh, what is this? Juggling balls, whatever they are. Whoops. Walk right into it. Okay. Got two objectives there. Killed by mine. Survival onslaught of shurikens. Survive for 40 seconds. Again, stuff I've already done, but we're not getting credit. Okay, so the uh, what what it, the spew of bullets? It only spews in this direction so far. I've seen it a few times. Let's go for that 40 second objective, I guess. Because I don't know where the shurikens are and. I'm not sure if I've survived the shurikens or not. I'm pretty sure I have, right? Forty seconds. Ah, gosh, when these fire brats are moving in a tangential direction relative to the circle, it's so hard to just get out of the way. Okay, onslaught of shurikens. I guess we'll just keep on going until we find the shurikens. Alright, I 
I'm much better at staying out of the way of the exploding mines or boxing glove. Okay. What's next? These are the shurikens. <laughs> uh, that's the first time I've seen the shurikens, so I guess I'm a little SOL there. I just don't like how big the pills are. Your entire hitbox is probably your entire ship, and of course. I don't know what this attack is called, but that one's pretty easy to get out of. Uh, that one, whatever it is, those guided explosions, right? Best to uh, just keep on moving linearly and slowly in the orbit. To me, this is still the equivalent of a spew of bullets. But I don't know what it's... Gosh, why did I... <laughs> we'll just keep on going. I mean, it's pretty easy... A yeah, pretty simple game that I could talk through. Well, not so you can play this in multiplayer. I'm curious as to what the multiplayer looks like and uh, how that gets played. Be kind of fun, arcadey kind of fun. Those are just alternate explosions. Okay, I can deal with the fire breaths that way. Oh gosh, rockets! Right, this is like what killed me the very first time. That one, Rage Nuke. That was the Rage Nuke. Survive for 60. Survive against the Onslaught of sh Shurikens. That's always the. Yeah, I, I've only seen that Shuriken. Oh my gosh, what is this? Ah! It's a worm. Because of the orbital uh, nature of the, the movement, I uh, didn't see that. I should have known. Everything moves in a very similar... I mean, everything is patterned. Slightly random, but not by far. Um, this is pretty catchy retro synth music. Uh, got punched in the face. Who knows which one of those three we're gonna get first, whether it's play 25 rounds. At the rate that I'm dying though, wouldn't surprise me if it's that. Last time I did this, uh, I was towards the bottom of the screen, I don't think that's a good idea. Shurikens! Shurikens! Survive! Survive! Oh no! <laughs> it's 
So close. So close. Uh, I mean, I, I don't know how long that was going to go on for, but I assume not much longer, because these waves all have about the same amount of timing. So, each wave gets to about 10 seconds. I think, right? Or is it like... Yeah, they cut off at 19, 9, 19. Okay, so I could, I could... Nope, that one's a little bit quicker. But then that one. Oh gosh. I'm getting used to the hitboxes, that's for sure. Yeah, like that one ended a little bit quicker. <laughs> What's a fire pit? Instead of being on the edge, I figure being down the bottom is going to have my best bet in terms of better lateral movement. Well, I got that 60 second achievement, that's for sure. Looks like, um, speed is gone up after about a minute and a half. Oh, wait, these explosions carry more... These explosions carry more, um, weight. Uh, more frags, I think. Maybe. I think they do... Oh no! High score though. That was 25. Okay. Score grand total 25,000 points. Have I done that already? I don't know. Who knows? I'm not keeping track. We'll find out, I guess, if by the end of this run they say that, oh, I... No, these mines have the same number of frags. Um... Oh... Yeah, I got the... got to the number... 2,000 points. 2,000 points. That's my next goal. <laughs> Music is really catchy. I mean, it's kind of repetitive, but I don't really mind. It just feels kind of like that arcade, you know, arcade arena survival. It's so simple, straightforward. I should be over here. Once again, on the lateral edge of the screens, there's just more room for those bullets to go by you for you to see here if they're coming behind you. Oh gosh, I want to survive! Move in the same direction? Yes, we did it! Awesome! Oops. Alright, well... That's not, not something I've been... Survive the deadly spin laser. Not sure what that is. I, I'm sure it's something I've encountered now. I think I've probably encountered all the different uh, types of boss weapons. Such a simple concept for a game, but it works pretty well. Oof. That was tight. A little too tight? Get away from there. This is not the spin laser, because it's not a laser. So these are a series of random explosions. Jeez. <laughs> I think it's 
definitely wise to move in the, into the other direction. <laughs> oh gosh. Hmm. Gosh, when the music changes, it's like you've angered. I wonder if there's actually an end to this onslaught. Shurikens. Uh, oh well, I guess we won't find out yet. 2,000 points. 2,500. Survive the deadly spin laser. So I don't know what the deadly spin laser is, but um, I'm pretty sure that I'm going to stop playing this real soon. It's great for... Um, uh, it's great for a small sitting because each run is so short you know, minute, or, well, less than that, sometimes. Uh, yeah, less than that. That was less than 30 seconds. Boxing glove. Alright, let's, uh, look at our statistics. Oh, let's look at the objectives. We've gotten a bunch of these. Deadly spin laser. Oh, wait. So a bunch of question marks. Okay, so can't really see stats. 29 games, 17 minutes, average round time 36 seconds, 16 out of 50 objectives. It tells you what my high score is. That's, oh, that's by what? Explosion, boxing glove, etc. Okay, very nice. Um, I don't know what party mode is. Oh, okay, so you can have up to four players. I guess you can play two to four players in party mode, probably against the same kind of onslaught, and you just survive. It might be a... I don't know if it's considered co-op or whatever. Anyway, um... Yeah, pretty... Pretty nice, pretty nice little game, so I, I thought I'd scroll through the um, credits at least. This game is not um, available yet. Um, this game is coming out. Currently, the Steam store page just says... Uh, I can't quite remember what it... Does it just say quarter two? Or does it actually give it days? Um, I'll put the link to the Steam store page in the uh, video description below. Um, yeah, it was fun. Uh, I, I can definitely see myself playing this more just as a kind of a casual time killer. Is it something that I'm going to sit for hours to play at one time? Probably not. It seems like it could be a good party game with multiple people and just to have a good laugh. And Although, um, the hitboxes are pretty big, those bullets are huge, and um, it's easy to get hit because of being, you're, you're stuck on the circle orbit, um, but in any case, uh, yeah, it's a fun game, it's a fun game, um, I'll just wait until the game is actually released to actually give a full review, alright, thanks for watching, have a nice day, bye bye.